recognize me for my many YouTube videos. Uh, today we're in New Orleans for our annual convention for the Athletic Trades Association. I'm here with wonderful people of Shuttle Systems, and I'm going to talk about progression on the Shuttle Balance. Um, recently there was a question posted on the Shuttle blog about quantitatively measuring uh, proprioception balance. And what we do at uh, our clinic is twofold. We'll do it on either advancement, on what they can handle, and also time length. Um, but just on how they can handle it, we'll start with simple bilateral balancing. Um, have the patient with you know shoulder width apart and make sure they can balance, hands to their sides, looking straight ahead. When we know that they can handle this with perturbance and everything, we'll then advance them tandem. Tandem, they can do it either leg, standing forward, and again, have them looking straight ahead, balancing. Have them switch feet. Either way works. When we finally know that they can master that, we'll go to the unilateral. This is where you can go more advanced. And you're kicking into the sides, making it balance. Uh, as I've shown in other videos, you can have them play and catch. Um, catch on this is so much harder than on a trampoline. I've tested that with many of my patients, and it, this is by far more advanced. Um, and when we go from there, it, the sky's the limit. You can take the bands off to make it looser. It's just, it's. Love it. Ricky Landry, KD, and a physical therapy. We use the shuttle balance for upper and lower extremities. We, uh, to add resistance to our shoulder patients with push ups, we attach one resistance band on one side and one resistance band on the other side to get the board. And we have the patient straighten the board out and uh, gets the resistance and you perform push ups. So you get, you get the strengthening component and you get some proprioception. Um, I'm a student athletic trainer and recently one of my athletes had an ankle sprain and for part, he's a throwing athlete, for part of his rehab we use the balance system. We have him stand in the middle of the board and he balances on one ankle at a time and then we just have him go through his throwing motions and it, we make it harder by moving the chains in as well as we can elevate the board to make it more difficult too. And then he just goes through his throwing motion with either a ball for his sport or a weighted small medicine ball and we just toss it back and forth. Um, and he tries to sustain the single leg stance through five tosses and if he misses one we have to start over.